Now here the questions consider a circle x square plus y square equals 1. So we have this circle center at origin and radius equals 1. And then this other circle center at 4, 0 and radius 3. That says now a circle is touching S and S dash. So this is S and this is S dash, and also their direct common tangent, then its radius is. So we have this direct common tangent, and we need to find radius of this circle which touches these two circles and this line. Now basically there are two ways to solve this question, and the first method is. Descartes rule of kissing circles. Descartes theorem of kissing circles. And here we talk about curvature of fourth circle which touches these three circles. We have to consider the straight line as a circle whose radius is infinite and therefore its curvature is 3. So here k3 is 0. k1 is 1 and k2 is 1 by r which in this case is 1 by 3. So this k4 will be equal to k1 plus k2 plus k3 plus minus 2 into under root of k1 k2 plus k2 k3 plus k3 k1 where each of ki is the curvature of these circles where curvature is 1 upon ri and this curvature is positive if circles touch externally and it is negative if circles touch internally and for this straight line we have taken radius as infinite and if radius is infinite then its curvature is 0 so from here we can write k4 as 1 plus 1 by 3 plus minus 2 and here will be this 1 by root 3. Now this is 4 by 3 plus minus 2 root 3 by 3 or this radius will be 3 upon 4 plus minus 2 root 3. And if we rationalize it, we can write this as 3 into 4 plus minus 2 root 3 and this value is 4. Now since radius of this circle is smaller than these two circles, so for this radius we have to take this negative sign. So here this r it will be 3 4 minus 2 root 3 upon 4 and that is your option b. Now another way to solve this question is we know that length of direct common tangent in case of two circles which touch each other externally it is 2 under root r1 r2 so suppose we have three points a b and c now we can find this length a b it is twice under root r into 1 we can find b c which is 2 under root r into 3 and we can find this length a c which is 2 under root 1 into 3. Now AC is AB plus BC. So we can write 2 root R and this is root 3 plus 1. It is equal to 2 root 3. Now this 2 and 2 will cancel. So we will get this R as 3 upon root 3 plus 1 whole square which is 3 upon 4 plus 2 root 3. Now we rationalize it. We can write this as 3 into 4 minus 2 root 3 upon 16 minus 12 which is 4. So radius of this smaller circle is 3 into 4 minus 2 root 3 upon 4 which we got from the Descartes theorem as well. So answer to this question is this option B.